Hello everyone, my name's Super, Destiny Enthusiast, and today we're going to be going over one of the best bottom tree Dawnblade builds I've ever made. Now, for this build, you're going to want to have Sunbracers with either Sunshot or Tiku's Divination. For this build, you're going to want to be on bottom tree Dawnblade. This will allow for any enemies that are affected by a burn effect to explode once defeated. This will also chain throughout enemies causing a massive chain of explosions. Now, for mods, you're going to want to have Explosive Wellmaker, where rapidly defeating combatants will spawn a solar elemental well. Now, whenever you get a kill with your melee or your grenade ability on bottom tree Dawnblade, you will cause an explosion which will kill the nearby enemies in chain, creating elemental wells on the explosion deaths. This will also work with Sunshot or Tiku's Divination, where whenever you get a kill that will cause an explosion, it will chain creating more elemental wells. Then you'll want to have Elemental Armaments. This will allow you to create wells when you get a kill with a matching weapon matching your subclass, in this case Sunshot or Tiku's. The explosions made from those weapons will also create Elemental Wells. Then you'll want to have Sunbracers with Bountiful Wells. This is because Bountiful Wells will allow your other additional mods to stack, creating more Elemental Wells. Sunbracers will also allow for infinite solar grenades on a melee kill. Those solar grenades will also create explosions that will chain once an enemy is defeated, creating more elemental wells. This is why you'll want to put on two copies of Elemental Ordinance, where getting a grenade kill spawns an elemental well. Having two of these mods on with bountiful wells will stack, creating more elemental wells on grenade kills. This will feed into the synergy of Sunbrazers and will also feed into the synergy of the subclass, where getting explosion kills of the subclass or Sunshot or your abilities will spawn in elemental wells, allowing you to chain this combo for pretty much forever while keeping your abilities up. I'm also going to recommend you put on two outreach mods on your bond, just to keep your melee up in case you don't have it. Now that's it for the build, however if you want to take the build a step further you can put on either Solas's Scar or Code Duello with Chain Reaction, as they count as solar weapons and Chain Reaction counts as explosion kills. They will also create elemental wells. But you don't have to do this if you don't want to, it's just an extra thing that you can do. Now, this build is very flexible. You could replace one of the grenade mods with Font of Might or Font of Wisdom if you prefer. Now, you don't need High Discipline or High Strength for this build either. I'd recommend anywhere from Tier 6 to Tier 10 for both Discipline and Strength for this build to work. But, with that said, that's it for me. I'll let some of the gameplay footage play out for those of you who are curious and want to see how this build works and performs. My name's Super, Destiny Enthusiast, and I'll see you all in the next build.